What is going on guys? We're back with another video today and we are in our Chicago Bears franchise and it's a special day because it is the start of the playoffs, the divisional round it's against the 9-7 and seven Niners. I might have to take a look at their roster. Maybe we'll do that with all the teams. But yeah, the team, if you didn't watch the last video, got quite a bit of the upgrades. Uh, did Nash win MVP? I can't remember actually. He was MVP, which just makes no sense. So of course, win, lose, Super Bowl win, lose. We have another season regardless. So if you guys want to see a stream, despite the fact that uh, we only have one or we have no first round or second round pick uh, for the, you know, want to see a stream for the off season. I want to see 100 likes on this video. If we have another playoff game, I want to see 100 likes for that video. If we make the Super Bowl, 100 likes for that video. Just to show you guys, or show me that you guys do want to see one, despite having you know no first or second round pick and probably nothing crazy in free agency. If not, I'll make a video for it. So either way, it doesn't matter. But yeah, I'd like to see it. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this game. Eh. But I also upgraded the sliders or updated the sliders, I suppose. I pretty much put everything uh, five in their favor. So if it was on our side, I dropped it five. If it was in their side, we dropped it. Uh, we raised it five. <laughs> that would, uh, you know, rule it out. So you can see they have a bit, uh, you know, a couple players on defense that are pretty talented. Jimmy Garoppolo, he's not super great, but he's definitely got enough to get it done. Deep accuracy might be a little bit of a rough one. Running, though, they got some pretty fast running backs. McKinnon has always been a problem for me, so I am a little worried. Uh, let's take a look at wide receivers. You do have a very fast player, Marquise Goodwin. Everyone else, though, is not going to be a problem. Tight end, Kittle. Of course, this was started before the season uh, started, so he's not really that great of an overall. Has potential, and he is fast, but, yeah, he's not going to be that big of an issue. Not really worried about their offensive line too much. Defensive line is, you know, it's got a lot of potential. They're just not really doing super well but yeah i mean well look at that i mean that's just not great <laughs> it really isn't uh i'd probably put deforest buckner on the inside so he plays a little bit more i know he's technically dt so he plays inside but you know what i mean uh nate carter star dev uh pass rusher he looks pretty good but he is a little slow they could have some uh pass rush uh success against us in this game defensive backfield pretty solid as well so maybe i uh underrated him a little bit maybe i overlooked him so we're in 91 overall, they're in 83. I don't really expect many teams to have the kind of uh, team that we have anyways. Here it is, the first playoff game. We have easily locked up home field advantage for the playoffs. So if we win out, it's staying in Chicago until we make the Super Bowl, which I don't even know where the hell the venue is for that. I ain't worried about that. I'm worried about one game at a time, like Jordan Sparks, kind of. Boom. Super Bowl. What? So it's a little bit of a sunny one. Uh, they must not consider the Niners very good either because we probably should be playing at nighttime since we're the number one seed. But number one versus whatever the hell this team is, probably the six. Jordan Howard in the corner over there. Usually that's huh, that's interesting. I don't know if it's a new, a new screen because of the playoffs. I don't pay attention. But did you guys expect me to? I never do. But Nash Adcock, the league's MVP. What a bad season for the NFL because... Jesus Christ, our 22-year-old slash 34-year-old rookie, as he looks kind of old, uh, is the guy. So Atlanta on the other side, if Atlanta doesn't win this, are we, I mean, to be fair, the Giants are very good in sim, but if Atlanta doesn't win, are we just going to have a free shot to the Super Bowl? NFC doesn't really look too hot here. Niners and Giants are in the division around. That's, that's interesting. I, I'll tell you what, that is a little shocking. So Houston on the other side did win. I believe that was our opponent in the Super Bowl year one, wasn't it? 36, I mean, to be fair, we did have a pretty good season. We just fumbled, like, way too much. To be fair, I don't know. Maybe it's not really a, a Madden favoring the user thing, but more Madden not factoring in fumbles. Here we go. First play, of course, no return. Like I may have said, I don't remember. I have Alzheimer's. And, uh, all right, so a loss of one to start. Well, gain of one to start the game. It sure as hell felt like a loss of one. All right, so their, uh, their coverage might be a little bit better this week, which is a little worrisome. Inside, Trey is overthrown. Yikes. Not a good start there, Nash. You're the MVP now. You got to gotta actually look the part these days. <laughs> Before, you know, you're under the radar. Now everyone's watching you. Probably shouldn't have told you that. They look like they actually... Huh. Are they... Did they move to a 4-3? Did they do that at one point? When did they do that? Here we go. Looking for a first down. Burton is open, and the throw is good. Burton catches it. I had Anthony, but I didn't think he was going to make it, so I I waited. 
Browns also win. See, now the Browns I can allow because they have a little bit of potential. They have a lot of youthful players. Baker could be a 99 overall by now. But the Giants, really? Oh, God. To be fair, they did have a rookie quarterback, too. I mean, I got to start paying attention to this game. The rookie that I thought could have some success this game already proven that well. And the Giants win. All right, so whoever wins this game plays New York. And with the lack of uh, commitment to this game for me, it might not be us. I'm, I'm just thinking ahead too much here. We got a, I mean, we got a team here that, that is looking. I have Y, but I have to just take Cohen. And it was a good decision. Cohen is only a few yards short. That throw to Y might have been rough because the safety was nearby. I don't know. I have a pitch look here. I don't like it. Do I trust the right side here because they're playing really off? I do. And nobody covers him, but Howard doesn't need it. Howard is gone. Sherman, of course, why wouldn't he be one of the guys there? But look at the play by Howard. That is a beautiful run of 54 yards. It was uh, not a great drive, but anything that ends in a touchdown will be fine by me. Second and four, they ran it once already. They're going to throw it this time, and oh, I get beat. He, he tricked me. He probably should have waited a second longer. Because I was going over the to the right side a little bit to get that wide receiver. Very lucky. on If I was Roquan, I'd probably get the pick. He caught me leaving, but he was a little too early. Got a little happy with it. And there's a pick for Danny. I'm going to have to not use a linebacker because Jimmy Garoppolo is... Ooh, that's, I thought that was going to be a fumble. Jimmy Garoppolo not seeing the field super well so far. And I had X, but I couldn't get it to him. Buckner gets us. Just a little too long in the progressions. They do cover him. I'm going to have to take a quick throw. And Hughes drops that. Are you serious? With the wind against us, we could have been around the 40. Maybe pinned him around the 10. Uh-oh. Oh, they almost get a block. That is exactly the type of thing they need. And Williams cannot get him down, and Manning has to. So they're going to start at the 33 instead of what could have easily been maybe the 10 or 5 if Hughes holds on. Call what you want, but he probably doesn't field the ball if we uh, if we have that extra 10 or whatever to punt it. Mac off the edge. Mac gets the free rush. I hit him late. That was a rough one. They gave him the first down on that. That's, uh, that's a little bit of an interesting call there. We're in Chicago. We're used to getting the calls our way. And there's nowhere to go, and who gets him? Amos. Mac taking the double team. Amos getting a free rush, basically. Kind of like how our drive happened. You know, when you get that, that sack on first down, it really... It really makes the drive rough. Mac has a chance. Hits him inside, and he misses the angle. And Manning, we know for a fact, is not the fastest guy. Who was that Amos that missed that? Both teams kind of reeling, and then they both come up with a big play in a rough situation for a touchdown. This has uh, become a game. Amos misses it. Howard to the left side. Howard gets a little bit of a block. Sherman is going to bring him down with an arm tackle. That's... Sherman's been good in run support so far. Good enough, I suppose. Did get blocked pretty long there. I don't know. I'm liking the, what I'm seeing with Howard. I mean, look at Howard fighting inside that tiny little... There was a little lane, and he gets it. Were we setting teams up? Were we were we making them believe we're a, a pass-first team when really we're really just a team that loves to run the ball? Inside, perfect throw on the run. Allen Robinson takes it to the 34. Want to show the trust in the run game. Here you go. Third and one right up the gut. Howard gets popped, but he does get the first down. Jesus, Ruben. Here goes the blockers, the guys in front, and there goes Sherman again. Like I said, he has been good in run support, especially the last few plays he's been in on. Allen Robinson on Sherman. I'm going to take it. Oh, good play by Sherman. I actually thought Allen had him. Inside, who is this? Anthony Miller. Oh, another huge hit inside. Was that Ruben again? He was on the slant. I trust him. Oh, my God. Is that Ruben again? Ruben Foster is actually insane. I'm rolling out with Nash. And I, I hesitated. I don't know if you guys seen that, but I actually, I actually kind of backstabbed. I'm surprised I didn't fumble there. Height plus four. So he's definitely not on the right. Back in the end zone. He misses the throw. Nash, no. Anthony Miller is a route running specialist. He's killing it. And, of course, he misses the throw. That's a field goal. And Floyd drops the pick. He's dropped so many this season. It's unbelievable. But he's a pass rusher after all. It's definitely one of those if only we would have uh, executed when we should have type plays. 
when you're thinking back on the season and inside Floyd misses the tackle. It's all right. It's all right. I, uh, you know, I actually uh, agree with the decision there for Floyd to just go all out, try to pop him to just maybe get a lucky drop. Maybe not. It gets the blitz anyway. That's the power of a really good blitz, especially if they run play action. Even if it's not a run, the quarterback doesn't make a quick read. You can still get that sack. Get a press on the linebacker inside, and I force the drop with Roquan Smith. That's a clutch play. I mean, you got some really interesting names here. Oh, God damn it. Oh, you idiot. Oh, you idiot. Oh, my God. I should have just left it. I really should have. But at the same time, Callahan's fast. If he catches it, I can kneel it. You know, I can kneel the ball. Even, even after this. Get the ball, man. What are you doing? Oh, my Lord. It makes me look so stupid. But at the same time, how many times I've done that in this franchise? Not, not that any of them are really gone for a whole lot of yards, but... How many times I've had that look. Look at Howard. And Sherman makes a bad look. Howard already over 100. No, really? 9 for 111? Are you serious? I'm going to take him. He doesn't really have the look. And he holds on. Wow. I mean, on that play, Weatherspoon is really not that short. So, I mean, I really never thought about it. But they're actually perfect for us. Like, their defense is actually, like, almost perfect. To stop our uh, our attack. Look at the throw. Great catch by Anthony Miller. The maneuvering of the pocket by Nash there was beautiful. They have the wrong side sack. This should be a walk-in. Maybe not. Oh, good play by Copa. I love that, man. Two touchdowns for Howard on the day. And we regain the lead. I just can't believe who wins this game. Like, it could be a Niners-Giants NFC Championship. Maybe we're talking like 2014, that's doable. But this this year, really? One year in, and look at Fuller. You got beat quite a bit there. Two-minute drive here. This could, uh, this could be a huge drive for them. He might have gotten the ball first. Oh, what a throw. Recovery of a lifetime by Trevor, but he still holds on. Look at the, uh, the outside route. Oh, my God, Kittle. Please don't. He ran, either, ran over either Floyd or uh, Trevathan. Either way, that's impressive. You keep going with these quick throws, and it's hurting them. So I'm going to kind of make them forced to look at the quick throw. To the outside, that's a pick by Trevor Williams. Even better than getting the ball back, we take the ball back. I almost call him Shalom Thomas, isn't it like Solomon? Shalom. Shalom Thomas. To the outside, Cohen 101. I don't like this. Good block on Sherm. I mean, what am I even doing at this point? We have three timeouts. If we can convert, we can still salvage this thing. There we go. There we go. 20 seconds left from the 37. Hughes is... Oh, what a swat. I was worried about that. I definitely saw that happening. Good play by Rackley. I don't even know who that is. The main looks on this play never works. To the outside, that's great coverage. And another swat down, man. 11 seconds left. We need to get about 20 yards here. Ooh, I had Trey. To the outside, what a throw on the money. And Anthony Miller gets just about exactly 20. Ooh, I might have missed. The wind will not take. And that's a good field goal to extend the lead. There is one second left, but... I'm just going to try to squib this if I can. Flecked into us. That's a great kick. Someone actually called that the perfect kick. And there is a flag. It's probably going to be against the receiving team. But if it's not, I think they might get an extra play here. Yeah, it's a legal block in the back. I'm almost certain they do get the ball here. They get the ball. We're, uh, we're primed for a really good matchup here. You know, if Jimmy Garoppolo doesn't throw that pick in, you know, I don't know if it was even the red zone, but near the... Near the end zone. Wow. Who had 500 yards? Was that Eli? No, they have Jordan Lay now, don't they? They have a rookie, I believe. It's probably not a smart look to come with a super heavy run formation. There we go. Roquan. Filtration system. If it works, it works. But it's it's not really working now, is it? Oh, look at the throw. And Fuller recovers. That's on Pettis, I think. I don't know. I, think, I don't think he trusted his receiver, actually. An, oh, I'm taking that. Oh, what a throw. And damn, once again, is that Witherspoon? It can't be. That's uh, Rackley, I think. 
I don't like those far throws for Adcock. Without the throw power, it's almost impossible to hit those. And I can't motion him in. All right, fair enough. I have Burton inside, and that, that's close to pass interference. What a play by Ruben. 59 yards away. Can we actually uh, take the two-point here? We do have the win, so. Oh, that's a really good kick. And we barely make it. We have a couple of yards to spare, but we take the nine-point lead. We'll come with the blitz. It'd be a bad time for them to run the ball. Oh, maybe not. Fuller on the outside gets spun on Eddie Jackson, who really doesn't get his name called a lot, which, I mean, hey, that might be a good thing. Oops, I took the really bad angle there. There you go, Eddie. Take a shot deep. I don't even know. And he's in trouble with a Keem Hicks all over him, and he takes the sack. If they can, I know the wind's against him, but if they can get about five yards on that play, they probably get a field goal. Got a couple of routes that could score. Not score, but get a first down. Jesus. I'm about to take this throw. Robinson drops it, almost tipped into the hands of Reuben Foster. We are struggling a little bit in this second half. Danger of Ethan, free rusher. When you get that play action and the center leaves it, that's a free rush. I'll take it. Second and 18, you can't run the ball here. You just can't run the ball here. Unless you're them, then you can. And Mac, wow, what a play. I shed it off a, of a double team. Switch off to get the angle. The angle forces him inside and Mac kills him. I'll tell you what, I like a good team effort play as much as the next guy. Callahan, can you make up for your uh, mistakes earlier? And Amos gives up another big play in a huge uh, situation. Amos has been a liability today. Oh, look at the play by Floyd. And he can't get any help. Look at McKinnon. Floyd has to chase him down. The effort from these linebackers are just unmatched. It's just unmatched. The entire linebacker core we have, the level of effort. Oh, what a play. And McKinnon with a great one, but Roquan's fast. Does he get the first? He does, but that's all right. We brought the blitz to the opposite side. It was basically Roquan versus a touchdown. Play action. I'm worried inside. I saw that late and Garcon to the 24-yard line. Inside Roquan. I missed the tackle again. I knew they were going to run it and he's got nobody in front of him. A broken play. I should have called a timeout. I didn't know what to run. We audible late and they're within one. Burton underneath. Burton runs into Sherman but a good eight-yard gain. It's all right. I believe in Howard. I believe in Howard and a face mask. That is what I'm talking about, Howard. When it looks unlikely, the man just lowers the shoulder. He doesn't care about the punishment. The outside, Trey Burton. He gets the first down. Burton stiff arms a man to the 33. We're in that good spot of the field right now. We got a bit of a wild one here. Oh, I was about to take Trey's butt naked, and the rookie comes up with a huge... Clutch sack on second down. Yeah, I, I waited just a little bit longer just to make sure I wasn't making a bad read. You just you can't throw a pick here. You just can't. Honestly, I almost feel like I should run the ball. Here they go again with the pressure. I'm going to have to throw this away. Hopefully we have the range for a field goal. The kick is up and... And another clutch field goal, man. We're up by six with six minutes left. Coming with a little bit too much of a run-stopping front, but I thought maybe they would run it there. To the outside is wide open. How does Kittle keep coming up with these plays? That should have been picked. Kind of want to get a chip. No, I can't. I got to go. And Danny with a huge play. Third and six now. Danny is he's showing us that how he played last year in the playoffs right now. Hicks and he does they don't need to worry about it because they get a first down over the middle. Danny backs off too much. Leaves the fast good one wide inside. They're gonna run the ball here. No, they're not. They tricked me to the outside and another catch in traffic by Kittle. And it is, but we get tricked. I knew it was a run, but at the same time, it kinda looked like he was pulling that thing back. Come on, guys. Let's make a play. And we don't make a play. And that's another wide open lane. And the Niners are going to take the lead. Are we going to leave it onto the leg of, uh, of uh, Cody Parkey one more time? Maybe we don't need to. And Cohen, good play. 
Brought down by the kicker. Threw a block, actually. Cohen wide open. Great play on the special teams. Great play here. Cohen kind of similar tackle as before to the 49. Trey Burton wide open. Quick throw. Trey gets tackled from behind by Ruben. Might have been a bad decision, though. Second and one. I trust Howard, but, man, this front is scary. The line does a great job. I think you got to play it safe for the field goal, but at the same time, I, I think we need the clock. So I'm going to keep playing it like it's a normal drive. Keep playing it like we need a touchdown. And there goes Adcock. He's got room. Don't fumble. Oh, my God, a huge hit. Adcock, that might be the most clutch play he's had all season. I want to be, I want to be like a yard away here. And Cohen, man, Sherman, like I said, has been killing it. They have the chance to ice us. And Howard gets taken out. What a clutch tackle by Ruben, man. The sweep has went pretty well for us this game. They do look like they have it covered. I'm going to take this right up the gut. Come on, Copa. I've been trusting you all game long. And the chase down is not quick enough. Oh, it is. It looks good to me. We take the two-point lead, but there is still a minute and nine seconds. I'm actually worried here. You know, even when they score the touchdown, I was, you know, a little bit worried. Don't get me wrong, but there's just something about a minute left for that for this team where they've just can't I mean, they've just made so many clutch plays. Good job. Uh-oh, please be on them. Please be on them. I don't see how it would be on us. That is a huge penalty. That's going to put them at their own 15. Basically, I know they do have the wind, I think, which really sucks. Even now, I'm still thinking this is this is a good chance for them to win. To the outside. Come on, Callahan. Great play, man. Great play. Is that Callahan on Kittle? To the outside. That's a great throw. Oh, my Lord. Jesus. What a damn play. Booth review, please. Please tell me you missed it. Fuller gave him that tackle right at the last second. Please tell me that left foot. It had to be the left foot if it would have been. Yeah, that last second effort, I, I think he got it, though. Good try to, you know, review it, but, yeah, I wasn't super confident in that. That's a good play by us. I, I had to bring the blitz there. I feel like we've been giving them way too much time. Kittle has been easily their, their biggest target of the game. To the outside, and he finds them. He stays in bounds, but they're at the 39-yard line. I honestly don't know what to do. I have no clue. I actually hate the situation we're in. Lord. To the outside. Oh, my God. You've got to be kidding me. Callahan just lost us the game. Callahan has just literally lost us the game. Callahan, if you bring him in bounds, we win the game. Callahan slips. He slips Callahan's tackle. And they're in a position to win this game right now. Somehow block it. I'm so bad at these. Come on. And I missed it. Oh, three seconds left. Please squib it, man. Please squib it. If they don't squib it, I think we've lost the game. We'll kick it deep. I have to call a fair catch. And Cohen misses the fair and we lose the game. We've actually lost the game. Callahan is going to be up for trade. He's on the block. He's officially on the block. We played a great game, and Callahan chokes it. Callahan actually chokes the game. Don't get me wrong. There's plenty of players that made mistakes that you know we could have won the game because of. But he actually ruined the game. I can't believe that. That is ridiculous. We had a chance at a back-to-back -back run, and we didn't. Adcock also, I mean, he didn't throw a pick, but he kind of choked in the biggest stage here. You know, only 191 yards, missed a couple of throws. That Anthony Miller one, like we said, looking back at it, we put up what? How many points? We put up, I don't even know what the score was, but we'd have had an extra four points if he if he makes the throw like he should have. Look at the run, ground game. Very similar from both teams. We played better. Oh, man. I can't believe we actually lost. We really lost that game. No receiver with really a lot of yards. Jimmy Garoppolo, he just kept gunning. 
His completion percentage was great. It's just they threw a couple of picks. Like I said, I mean, don't get me wrong. A lot of players contributed, but you look around. It's It's got to be Callahan as the main, main culprit. Cody Parkey, absolutely ridiculous game. Five for five. <sighs> Man. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Ridiculous, Cohen. I mean, at the end of the day, honestly, if we would have had to, you know, try to get a 90-yard play, it just wouldn't have happened anyways. So either way, it's maybe I should have just let Cohen try. I mean, we did try anyways, but obviously it was a little bit less, you know, more on the spot attempt than we would have liked. If you guys want to stream, I want to see a hundred likes on this, and uh, I'll probably put it at the video beginning of the video. Not to, you know, I'm not gonna spoil it for anyone, but we will go to the Super Bowl. We will see uh, who is in it. The Niners have a good look. No, this is the Giants, so let's take a look at what happened there. Man, really. I mean, it was a hell of a game. I, I appreciate that game. I'm glad we didn't just walk through and just win a Super Bowl, but that was winnable. One point, man. Wow, what a game. Uh, and, of course, the very next week, the Giants win by four. Jimmy Garoppolo is so bad, and we lost to him. Like, as much as you could say... Um, this, this Nate Carter guy is pretty solid, by the way. Relatives of Lorenzo, 100%. But as much as you could say, oh, Danny Gervaith, and he had a couple opportunities to picks and all that, but, I mean, that's different, you know? Make, you know, getting a muff punt and then having a chance to recover and you just jump into the wrong way. And then you have a chance to bring him down and tackle him. I mean, if he brings him down inbounds there, we move on to the, to the championship game. But he let him slip out of it unbelievable browns probably win this super bowl wow baker mayfield in the championship game with six touchdowns that's crazy talk that's 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 nuts it's actually nuts uh let's i guess we already ruined oh no we didn't ruin the college cody white here so let me know you guys think we should re-sign just in case we don't hit the uh the goal copa i'm just gonna knock out right now because He's insane. I'm going to give him a four-year deal worth about five mil. I love him. He's my boy. Copa's my boy. Sorry, Valles. I didn't even know you were existent. But yeah, just in case we don't, let me know. Do you think we should re-sign um, Danny Trevathan? I think we would re-sign Cody Whitehair. He's pretty good. Uh, people tell me, uh, or someone told me, go feel general since uh, strong arm isn't working. We'll take a look. And we don't get a throw power. So yeah, I'm going with strong arm from now on. Or whatever it gives me short pass, maybe. But yeah, I mean, that was the season. Like I said, 100 likes, and we'll do a stream for this. I would assume this would... And we... Yeah, I mean, that was the season. <laughs>